Number 15. Police Station Ghost It's easy to break out of prison when you're a ghost. Redditor Shahir92 shares this footage of some paranormal activity that has police officers on edge. Judging by their reaction, those doors aren't automated. One officer even takes video footage of it. So what's going on here? Redditors in the comments have some theories as to what's really going on here. Is this just a pressure differential? Or do we have a haunting on our hands? Not a single loose sheet of paper rustled on the desk. So I'm leaning paranormally. And I think these police detectives need to investigate this further. Number 14. Demons What do you do when encountering a demon? Blast it with holy water. YouTuber Nikolai of Seeker of Ghosts does just that when facing off with a league of demons in the basement. After spraying holy water in one direction, he moves on to the next, but that's when the demon starts to turn out the light. The lights continue to flicker as the demon makes some noise. I'm not sure if the haunted house laughter is the demon or a paranormal device being triggered, but Nikolai isn't scared, at least not until he hears this. <laughs> this is the most evil guttural growl I've ever heard. It sounds to me like it came from the fiery depths below. Number 13. Nightmare House The Hinsdale House in New York is infamous for an exorcism performed there in the 70s. YouTube team Paranormal XP revisits the haunted place, and some viewers are seeing a face in the window during their investigation. Take a look. In the kitchen, I heard... It just caught the corner of my I eye. heard that I'm almost that like, yeah, my eyes are watering. Do you see it? In the kitchen, I heard it just caught the corner of my eye. I heard that I'm almost that like, my eyes are watering. There's something there, and it doesn't appear like a reflection of anything inside. In the kitchen, I heard it just caught the corner of my eye. I heard that I'm almost that like, get my eyes are watering. I see it too, and I'm completely freaked out. It seems to me like a demon is watching. Number 12. Icelandic Ghost Houses YouTuber Sindri Levi investigates the eight scariest ghost houses in Iceland, and he leaves, frozen in fear. In one of the first houses, a balloon freaks Sindri and his girlfriend out. What are you doing? Glad you could join me. No. It's moving, and there's no... We should go upstairs. Let's check out the upstairs. Upstairs is even creepier. Whole like roof here is just coming apart. You feel like you heard something. Yeah. At the next house, they don't know what to expect. This house actually had a door. So I opened it up and this happened. <laughs> that is the creep. I'm opening it and I'm going away. <laughs> oh my God, run! 
Oh my <laughs> God, <I'm free. laughs> no, kill him, kill him, kill him. When Sindri returns the next day with backup, he finds there's nothing to be afraid of after all. Whoa. Okay, this is a bit scary. Hello? Hello. Hello. I'm getting goosebumps. Okay, not scary at all. Bash some ghosts for me if he's young. What if the door would just like bang close? <laughs> or at least, nothing they can see. House number six looks the most frightening in my opinion. So we made it to house number six. It's not at all scary as you can see. We're about to destroy any ghosts that get in our way. Right, G-Man? Uh, yep. Check this out. I thought that was a cat for a second. <laughs> wow, the echo. Hello? Hello? And the guys seem to agree. Uh, I am not scared. You are scared. This is very... I will warn you, the f floor is collapsing. Whoa, I thought I saw something and I got goosebumps freaking everywhere. <laughs> We're aborting this. To see the mall, take a look at his channel. Although no poltergeist activity was experienced in the eight scariest houses in Iceland, the ambiance is bone chilling. Number 11, Fairfield Hospital. YouTuber Mo Sarji finds he has a stalker while exploring the abandoned Fairfield Hospital. The first clue is a gut feeling. Yo, I'm getting so many bad vibes in this part of the hospital. In an empty room with only a chair in the middle, Mo thinks he hears something. I thought I heard somebody walking in here. I'm just gonna stand here quietly. Is there anyone in this room? As he gets closer to the creepy chair, he senses something is off. What a creepy chair. Why is there a creepy chair just sitting right here in the middle? Yeah. Oh, something. There's something in there. They go to confront the guy together, but they may be too late. You guys hear that? Shh. You heard that? Hello? I heard some movement over here. Although no one approaches, they later hear a voice in the darkness. Stop moving! It's the homeless guy, he's freaking out. They continue through the building, and Mo hears a door slam. Someone just slammed a door over there. Although they never come face to face with the man, or whoever is stalking them, I feel they are in danger, and they probably shouldn't risk further instigating whoever or whatever's here. Number 10, Antwerp Mansion. Located in the UK, Antwerp Mansion has seen many a paranormal investigation inside its walls. YouTube team exploring the entity is here to conduct another at the UK's most haunted mansion. As the team enters, one of them sees a black shadow roll past. Hey, I've just seen some black roll down here. You are. I've just seen some black roll down here. They're touring the home when they hear two distinct knocks. Did you hear that? Then, on the staircase, a whistle is heard. What was that high pitch? It's something, but... What was that? That's a whistle. It almost sounded like a scream to me. After a moment, they hear something more. Yeah, what was that? In another room, one of the crew hears a floorboard creak but some in the comments hear a heavy breath. Listen closely. Oh! The floorboard creaked in here. Later, as they're descending the stairs, footsteps resound distinctly. Holy f Oh my f Oh my f 
you something. I've left my camera. This mansion seems to have an incredible amount of paranormal activity. I think if I were part of this team, I'd be calling it at this point. Number 9. Shadow Man McKay Mansion is home to a demonic shadow man. YouTuber Mackenzie Marie and her team face off with the entity in this creepy home, and it kicks off with a REM pod being triggered at the same time that they receive ominous messages on the spirit box. Yeah. Fell. Fell. Like down the stairs? Then there's just something about someone falling. Oh yeah, the guys on Ghost Adventures yeah, fell, fell down, down the stairs, stairs because of something in the attic. Yeah. That growled at them. That was the shadow man. Can you show me who growled at They then see something through these paranormal goggles that seems just a little too coincidental. Oh my god. Okay. No, 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 no. Oh my god. What was it? What was it, Jasper? What, it, what, what, what is it? It's an elderly woman. Oh my god. Let's see, it looks like the maid. There's Harriet right there. I get, I get so excited. That is cool. They come to the consensus that the image that the goggles conjured is, in fact, the maid. They then receive even creepier messages. The maid. It it's looks like, like that right there. Oh my god. Look. Dude, that looks just like the Look lady. The There's something else. Picture. It's the house. Again? It's the house. Good evening. Good evening. Ooh. It's nice oh to meet. The team splits up, and the pair in the hallway are having a hard time of it. Almost like she treats it like her daughter. Oh. Are you guys okay? They explain that they saw a shadow figure run past. Whoa. Should we go in? Are you good? Are you yeah, okay? We're about to walk out, and I saw a full on shadow. Like run by next to the cowboy, the prop. Yeah. So we should go in there. Yeah, yeah. I think I. Is it a shadow man or a shadow woman? I think it could be that creepy maid in shadow form. Number eight, abandoned house. Uploaded to EWT Clips, YouTuber exploring with Tom hears something off camera that makes him take up their equipment once again. Do you stay there? Right guys, <laughs> right, G said he heard something down there, I heard the two, it sounded like something from down there, so I turned on the camera, wait. <laughs> they go to investigate at the end of the hallway and capture some unexplained noise on camera. I don't know, let's just go down and see what it is. If anyone's here, if I'm not here. Hello? Do you want to go down first? A basement. Did you hear that? Here it is again. What's down there? A basement. What's in here with them? I don't know for sure, but it sounds demonic to me. Number seven, America's most haunted prison. West Virginia State Penitentiary is considered by some to be America's most haunted prison. YouTuber Call Me Chris and her partner Selena are here to investigate. As they're speaking to spirits through an app, they hear something behind them. To multiple people in here. Did you just hear a guy yeah. cough? That I was heard back there. Dude just cleared his throat. <clears throat> yeah, literally sounded like someone was like. <clears throat> Later, while doing a test drawing, Selena hears something nearby, and even in the absence of her senses, Chris senses it. Hello? Is that you? <sighs> okay. In interpreting Chris's drawings, they discover something chilling. I tried to decapitate the guy down in oh, the Oh, I hall. thought I was just scribbling for this. Nope. And then he wrote Jesse. I dreamt okay. about a guy named Jesse, which I saw a picture of in the fing room. You say? Yes. Yeah. Are you serious? Yeah. And, I think and it feels like the unknown is watching them. It's weird because, like, I can't. I don't even. Did you guys hear that? Can you shine your light over there? Dude, it sounded like somebody. They head outside, and while there, they see a flash of light in one of the prison's upper windows. That, there's a massive flash. Like, just randomly right here. Like it was like somebody, on the building? It was like somebody I saw that earlier. 
I thought someone took it. it. It looked like somebody took a photo through the window. Is someone else staking out this haunted penitentiary? I don't know if it is human or demon, but whatever is here, it's watching them. Number six, rooftop demon. That's not Santa landing on your roof. Reposted by Gumzak Lai. This video is trending in the Vietnamese speaking YouTube community. I was unable to track down the original source. The image shows a mysterious demon-like creature with glowing eyes crouching on a tin rooftop as people gather around to capture it on video. The creature wears a crazy grin on its face and its hands and fingers seem a bit off. What is this creature? What is it doing on the roof? And why are people gathered around to watch? I have a million burning questions and no answers. Do you know where this image came from? If you have an idea, please share it in the comments. Number 5. Monster Museum The YouTube team Twin Paranormal is exploring the haunted monster museum. When something terrifying goes down, their investigation begins with a search for the lady in black. ...with one of these devices around us. What was that? Did you hear that too? Yeah. Just a little knocking. Yeah. Why are you here? Mm -hmm. Is she here? I think she is, and she has more to say. Holy well, here. Whoa, well, what the f <laughs> Group of us. Group of us. Voices. Voices. What? They again receive many responses that seem to be on point. <laughs> Group of us again. Clowns. You're so close. Something just tapped on the cloud. Is the lady in black transferring through the clown? Maybe. And then they're told to run. I feel it. What does that mean? I feel something coming. Who approached us? Guys, guys, it said here I am. Something just. The demon announces itself and simultaneously confronts them. That was weird. That's weird. I see you, I see your twins! No. no. Way. Wait up. You guys got the threat. That's not. Funny. Guys, I. That last message would be all I needed to hear. This demon knows too much, and I believe it wants to do more than scratch them. Number four Goldfield Hotel. Would you be able to pass a night in the scariest hotel on earth? YouTube team Ghost Club Paranormal sleep over at the Goldfield Hotel and things get hairy pretty quickly. The spirits are reacting to their presence. I like the lights. I, I like, like the, the lights. lights. When you moved your light away from there, it said, I like the lights. It was almost like it didn't want to be in the dark. A moment later, Mandy sees something. What did you just see? Dude, I just saw somebody. Walk by the room? It was like black black yeah. shadow outline. Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he hangs out good near the most. I think he's the one that guards like, her. Right here. They head to the foyer where their devices register immediate activity. What is it? What is that? There it is. What the f dude? There is a presence in this room with them. Later, in a different part of the hotel, they capture a creepy EVP. He came, he came from just through that art. He came from just through that art. They start recording in order to speak to a spirit named Olivia, and she shows them her position. Olivia? Can you tell us where you are right now? She's in there. Thank you, Olivia. We're gonna come in, but We're please coming. do not be afraid, okay? It's okay? Later, when they play back the recording they've captured, they hear several EVPs. Morning. Yeah? Can you tell us where you are right now? Why would I, I didn't, did I say yeah?
I hear both yeah and leave. If someone was speaking in my own voice, I would take that as a cue to leave. Paranormal mimicry is no joke. It always points to something nefarious. Number 3. Creepy Farmhouse This creepy farmhouse in Oxfordshire is buzzing. YouTube team Real Evidence realizes early on in their investigation that the former residence is alive with activity. <gasps> what? Yeah, I don't know what they are. Let's get down in there and get out of here. Can you hear them all? Isn't that coming from outside? No, that's these. Well, I thought at first the buzzing could be bees in the walls. He then reveals what the sound actually is. At the state of all those flies, baby flies on the ceiling. Not sure if you can hear that through our mics at the moment, but it sounds like... The guys say they didn't notice these demon flies upon arrival. Literally. It is absolutely crawling with them. Demon flies everywhere. Yeah, yeah. I don't know how we did not notice that when we first come in here. And it seems to me that the fly demon is there, ruling over his fly kingdom. There's your presence. He can knock for us, he can say something for us. Did you hear that? Later, they hear another unexplained sound. Let's tap again. Is it the Lord of the Flies? That's my theory, and I think it's about to swarm its minions on them. Number two, abandoned Irish mansion. You have to trudge through a 500-year-old graveyard to get to this huge abandoned Irish mansion. YouTuber Matt of Finders Beepers History Seekers does just that in order to reach this place veiled in mystery and with the history of a monstrous reputation. He arrives at the place and it looks like the quintessential haunted house. You wouldn't see the red light. You can only see it through a camera which is because I'm always using mine. So I'm just gonna try and get straight over this middle bit and get in. Once inside, though it's fallen into disrepair, the grandeur of the place is impressive. That's... Wow, look at that. So I'm guessing that's the... That's not even the... That's not the entrance, is it? That's windows. That's shuttered windows. The size of the place makes it even creepier. There was two fireplaces. Look, these are all the old shutters and doors and stuff. And then some new wood as well, like they looked like they were gonna do it up. Yeah, look, that's new wood in the floor. As he's exploring, one viewer captures an obscure breath that is definitely not Matt's. I still keep hearing what sounds like running feet, walking feet. That's bizarre. I don't know who it could belong to. And later, another captures this strange grunt. Somebody just burped outside. That also doesn't sound like it came from him. While no ghosts are jumping out shouting boo here, this place gives me huge spirit vibes. I'm sure it's haunted, and these sounds we're hearing are definitely not the house settling. I've got a challenge for you. Since you've made it this far, why not like this video and hit subscribe in the next 5 seconds? Because I upload 4 new scary videos every week. If you're curious about what I look like in real life, then go to my Instagram at DylanIsChillinYT and tap that follow button to find out. Number 1. Estes Session Scratch This Estes Session is about to go sideways. YouTube team Rogues Hollow Paranormal is conducting a session when one of their own is confronted by something unseen. First, they're identified by name. Yeah, we can. It just said Trevor's name! Yeah, because I feel it behind me. The entity here seems to have grown attached to Trevor. Yeah, I, I feel it. Get off. You do not have permission to touch me. And then, Missy feels it behind her, too. Uh, yeah, I'm more of just like, right off you. 
According to the team, Missy was touched while Trevor endured three scratches on his back from the demon. I think such intense activity makes this video impossible to not forget. Think you're brave? Or are you the world's biggest scaredy cat? Test yourself with these 30 scary videos leaving viewers in fear and trembling.